So there is a technique of tapping with both hands on the fretboard. Playing a scale. It's a mix of hammers and pulling off. Pulling, hammers, hammer, ha, hammer, 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 hammer. Pulling off. Now, from that technique, it was on one string. Now you can work your scale on different strings. Now you can also start from that technique, derive from that technique. You can start having your guitar to sound like more non-tempered instrument, like fretless instruments, like in Arabic music, for instance, like the hood, you know. Not that you want to imitate the hood, but you can give a bit of a, a flavor of that, choosing the right scale, the right mode, of course, of playing. Then, when you treat the sound with your left hand, you know, it's not enough just to tap. You also have to accompany the sound with your left hand by vibrato. But here it's no longer the same vibrato that I described before, the classical vibrato. It's more an electric vibrato, electric guitar vibrato, meaning the movement is perpendicular to the, to the string. Right? Instead. But that also works. You see, you have, in fact, all those things are available for your palette of colors. See, my, my right hand here is really used like a hammer, really. I'm really... But I can also vary the technique of the right hand. And I can mix that with harmonics, which will be artificial harmonics, but obtained by tapping. You just have to look for them. They're there. That really expand the instrument. It's amazing. All, all of a sudden, all those colors which become available to you. <laughs>